I want to be a sports broadcaster. I've wanted to do it since I was 12, so I knew that um, I wanted to take journalism. And what I did was I emailed all the different schools that had journalism and uh, sent them all like my soccer resume. Sounds weird, but and like a video of um, myself playing soccer. And uh, yeah, heard back from a lot. Heard back from like Ryerson and Carleton and um, Concordia and Montreal and stuff, but none of them could guarantee the playtime that Kings did. Kings Athletics offers a few different programs for students. So we do have our varsity teams, uh, which there are open tryouts for at the beginning of every year. Our most popular teams are the men's and women's rugby teams uh, who play, the women's team plays in the ACAA and the men's team is going to be a club team next year uh, with Rugby Nova Scotia, so hopefully a higher level of play for them next year. Uh, we also have our men's and women's soccer teams who are very successful at the ACAA level and they compete at nationals every few years when they win the ACAA championships. Our basketball programs are also pretty successful. Our badminton program is very good this year. We have uh, three players going to nationals in a few weeks there. And our volleyball men's team is also in first place in the ACAA championships. Uh, with th they're also hoping to go to nationals in a few, few weeks' time. Players are honestly treated like gold at uh, our banquets and every time you walk into the gym you feel the love from everyone. And another thing with sports is that you get to travel everywhere. There is no, no other way that I would have got to see the Maritimes like I have with sports. And if your team makes it to nationals, you get to travel all over the country. The boys soccer team went to BC for a week, all expenses paid. and. That's fantastic. So. I just also think that my experience at King's has been totally enriched by my ability to participate on three varsity teams. Um, like I said, that couldn't happen anywhere else. In the locker room, in the hotels, in the bus, cranking out our team anthem, those are memories that I'm not going to forget.